please describe your job title and primary duties? Um, I was a server, basically, like my job was I'd, I'd get there and um, I had uh, about three or four tables, basically, and they, they rotate and my, my, my job was when I'd get there, I'd have to make sure that I had uh, all my side work ready. Basically, each server is assigned a different part of side work and that keeps their part of the kitchen clean at night. Someone could be like doing ice, someone could be um, stocking glasses or just anything, just making sure that whatever it is that, that like creamers or uh, they could be on salad dressing, like you never know like, what they're going to put you on. What was the work environment like? Um, actually, it was uh, like, a really, like a really fun work environment, like a bunch of people worked there that I knew and like we just had a good time every day. What was your favorite part about working there? Probably the people and the food, because <laughs> the food there's really good. Also, it was, it was surprisingly good. Like I, I wasn't expecting it, but um, and plus, I, my, my older brother, my older brother was one of the uh, like, what's that called? He was like a, like a supervisor, sort of in a way, like like a shift leader, and um, pretty much like uh, it was it was just a, like a really good time. Please describe a typical day as an employee. Basically, um, you're gonna you're gonna show up. Uh, you gotta have like your apron and names in like well, you don't have a name tag. It's just, it's this onto your apron, and then uh, you, you just make sure you have everything like ironed and everything and ready to go, and uh, you show up there at work. Um, pretty much, you just uh, it, it it can get really busy, and like you gotta make sure that you you learn the menu, like make sure that you know like all the the, the menu like backwards and forwards, and that's the main thing at the table is because when customers ask you about the different food, like you need to be able to t like let them know like, it, like I don't know, just be able to give them like helpful advice about it. How would you describe the application and interview process? Um, pretty much it's a uh, it's a it's a paper application, and like um you just fill that out. That's also they don't hire you right away either there and they, they will call you back, they'll check everything out and call you back and make sure that everything is good to go and then you have a job. What questions did the interviewer ask during the job interview? They ask you uh, actually like a lot of different questions. They ask you pretty much like because in the restaurant industry they want to know more about like you, like experience is like a, like a, is a key to them. Like they don't want someone who doesn't have any experience of working in a restaurant. Obviously everybody has to start like, Everyone has the, the, their first restaurant job, but uh, they're, since the day was such a high volume of customers, because like it was like a big thing in our town was the, the Cracker Barrel, that um, they want to make sure that there's, pe there's people who can like, I don't know, keep up with the pace and make sure that everything's getting done. What other advice would you give to a job seeker looking to get employment? I would uh, pretty much tell them um, to basically. Don't work in the kitchen. You could be a server because you'll make way more way more money that way. But as in any restaurant job, if you don't ever work in the kitchen, like always be a server. Because I'm done everything from wash dishes to, to wait tables to cook. And, I mean, and uh, it's the difference between making ten dollars an hour and twenty dollars an hour. So I would just rec definitely recommend going out there. And even if you don't like talking to customers, that's that's fine. Like you don't have to like talking to them. Just do a good job and be polite and make sure you get at that table. Make them happy every time.